lack of transparency, uh, the fact that there is no such thing at the IMF as a Freedom of Information Act. It's difficult to find out what they're doing. Uh, there was one occasion I describe in my, in my book, uh, uh, Globalization and Discontents, where the U.S. government gave uh, uh, a, a, an order uh, that uh, concerning how the rep U.S. representative at the IMF and the World Bank would vote on issues of what is euphemistically caused, called cost recovery. That's charging poorest children in the world for going to kindergarten, first grade, and second grade. Uh, the U.S. representative voted in the opposite direction. U.S. Congress said, you, you can't, you know, we can't, it's not, we can't uh, say that require poor people to pay for primary education. But our U.S. representative voted the opposite way. Could get away with it because it was all done in secret. No one knew. Well, the good thing about the one, one, uh, one, one good thing about this is that these organizations leak all over the place. And so eventually it leaked out that they, that they were disobeying Congress and Congress demanded he come, uh, the U.S. Uh, executive director explain. He said, oh, well, you know, I promise I won't do it again. We don't know whether he'll live up to that promise because it's going back into secrecy. 